All right, hey, it is uh, early Saturday morning, and I just thought I'd create a video here of this. I'm a beginner, Conlord guy, and uh, I'm going to show you a bunch of settings that or settings, and then there's my loadout. So I'm going to do settings first. This this all comes from knowledge that I gained from talking to not talking, but uh, watching Theta, the guy on YouTube. So Theta. Just do Theta Onward on YouTube, you'll find it. But to summarize really quick, there's two settings that he uh, said to have. It's like knife damage, require input, no input. And if with no input, knife will automatically deal damage to anything it touches. So this is, for beginners, you don't want to be killing your teammates even accidentally. I mean, some people come in and team kill just being jerks. But uh, just uh, just be careful with that, and then to just say require input. So when you take your knife out, and I'll show you. Well, I can't really show you because I don't have anything anybody else to demonstrate this against. But you have to pull the trigger to actually uh, kill somebody with a knife. And uh, so syringe use, no input. I think that's the default. Um, the other thing is where is it turn method scope shooting gun shooting holster type hip uh, dominant hand yeah i switched holster type to hip because i if, if it's on your chest you can accidentally grab it too easy if it's way down on your hip you are uh, gun stock i wonder i did order a gun stock kind of a relatively cheap one uh, I set my height, and uh, I'm right eye dominant. Um, let's see, scope smoothing enabled. Turn method snap, holster side dominant. Right bot, radio position left. Now with radio position, I always use my left arm to to engage the radio. I don't try to reach over with my right arm. And. Uh, let's see, turn angle. I thought there was another one where it, it, it's about running. Voice input, center, haptic, open. License is open. Mixed preset quest. Well, I have a quest to HDR. High dynamic range increases the range of how loud and how quiet the audio can become. It's optimal experience of when using Quest in Quest speakers. So I, I always have just uh, I use the Quest headset. It's really a good headset. So I don't see it. Hold the grip, object grab, gun control, sprint. Oh, outer edge. That was it. Outer edge. So sprint control determines whether or not you need to push a thumbstick. If you're always pushing your thumbstick. To run, it'll wear out your controller. So, two things. One is the knife damage, change it to require input. The other one is outer edge. Set your player height. Uh, that, that'll make sense once you're playing the game. And uh, set, you know, your, your right eye dominant for a lot of people. Um, and then put your uh, holster on your hip. So those are the settings that I use. And a lot of that comes from just... Uh, working or listening watching theta on his channel so he has he's got a lot of beginner videos so if we just jump in um what you want to do is just go to a shooting range first you don't want to well let's get rid of that shooting range and go go to a shooting range in the day um all these are day there's one night um, you can get kind of crazy in there if you go, go with a lot of people. So. This is the range. Looks like there's nobody in here, so I'm just going to grab um, the bulk. And for beginners, uh, the, the class you use the most would be Rifleman. Just to start out with, don't worry about any of these other classes. So in the Rifleman, what you what you care about 
in your loadouts is this 30 rounds for magazines that's the most rounds you can get and it's uh, semi-auto full auto um, the, the, the AK-12 if you go with the SKS you get 20 rounds for magazines now look if I change that back to AK-12 it's 30 rounds in four magazines so you get more ammo that's why I go with the AK-12 now on optics either go with the holographic site or red dot site uh, don't waste any points on getting these 4x scope they're very hard to use I'm, I've never and I've never used angle grip so for beginners just stick with holographic and red dot it's the easiest I, and what I do is I switch um, uh, my I have two different loadouts one for night and one for day this is my night loadout and uh, so the, the main thing here is uh, foregrip don't waste your time with uh, laser sight. It gives your position away. Uh, the suppressor, it, you know, some people use them if you're using doing co-op, so it doesn't uh, alert the enemy, and you get a bunch of guys running at you. But in watching Theta, uh, he doesn't use one because one, it's a lot of points. Two, um, you don't have a lot of points here, so. Two, uh, it doesn't really do much for you, um, so I just don't. I just worry about foregrip. And foregrip, obviously, you can see the recoil. If you take off your foregrip, you're going to have more recoil, so it reduces the recoil. So that's good. Now the gun, don't waste any points on guns. You're not going to use guns. The only way I, the only time I use that thing is is if I'm out of ammo, I'm in a tight quarter, and I got bad guys coming through a door, I'll go I'll go for my gun rather than try to reload. On uh, big maps, your smoke grenade is the grenade you want to hide your movement with. Um, if you're in a CQB tight quarter, your flash grenade is what you want to go with. Um, I just load both and uh, night vision as well for my night loadout. So those are the basics. Holographic sight, foregrip. Uh, don't, don't bring regular grenades if you're a beginner, a frag grenade, because if you don't know how to throw those things, you're gonna uh, kill teammates and they'll get pissed off at you. So, um, and then have a night vision. So don't waste any points on your gun, uh, on, on your pistol. So you can see I have my AK-12 set up as my, uh, this is my night loadout and my G3A3 I have set up with, uh, you know, both basically both flash and smoke. Not sure what map, you know, if I'm not choosing the map, what map I'm gonna be getting in. I do switch the foregrip, I'm sorry, I do switch the holographic site out for a red dot site. I like that better in the daytime. Uh, there's, it gives me more space to look at other enemies coming in uh, that are coming in whereas the holographic takes a little more space you, you, you know, your, your vision isn't as good so but I like it better at night I like holographics at night better just a personal preference and uh, body armor I don't include body armor uh, because <coughs> I don't have the points for it but I'd rather go for an extra syringe then body armor, so you take off the syringe, and you go to body armor, then you're over the points. So body armor, I also heard there's a bug <coughs> where it doesn't work anymore, and it's so negligible uh, in terms of uh, what it gives you, then, then don't don't mess with it. So, so let's it's like see. a rosy. I shoot it, it goes in. I mean, kept... Yo, man, what's happening? Um, so then specialists finish this out G363 is uh, 6C is the only one I get for both loadouts I have a night vision and a, and a, day, a, a day loadout <gasps> a night loadout um, but it's basically the Dude, same it is holographic red so light, red dot. early or I guess it's late Yo, to me what are you having? what's up? what's up? 
PKM. How's your day been? Ah, doing okay. It's been a good day. So the PKM, I use PKM of... on the support. And uh, again, night vision, holographic. Well, I guess I don't use holographic there. Let's switch that. Let's switch that to... Man, today has been a whole bunch of bullshit. Really? Yeah. Why? Why? What's going on? I don't know, just fucking girls, it's fucking complicated and I can't do this. Oh man, that sucks. Uh, so on this I one... I get with this is... one chick and then her ex starts causing a whole bunch of shit. Makes me feel like a horrible person. Her ex what? Her ex-boyfriend. Oh. Yeah, when it comes to, like, uh, girlfriends... Yeah, it's um, irritating. Unless I'm, unless I'm married to her and I get divorced, I wouldn't call her ex. I just, uh, I, I'll just say, you know, uh, old girlfriend. Well, My, you know, you know what it is, you know what it is. But still, I was not expecting this to come out of it, but everything's fine now. They're all <laughs> glad to just mm. cut everything off. Mm. Yeah. It's like I was there when they were.